Johnson Hughes. Chelsea told minimum 18 6.3 million pounds link price tag for 22 year old Serie A star. According to Italian outlet Carsi Mercato, have tipped to football dot London. Juventus currently have no intention of selling Mathis de Ligt, who has been on the radar of Chelsea. The Dutch defender has two years remaining on his current contract with a Turin based club. It is, however, suggested that the Italian club would want a minimum offer of 83.6 million pounds link for the 22 year old defender. It is also thought that the former Ajax Amsterdam player could be given the captain's armband next season, with uncertainty looming around the future of Paolo Dybala and Giorgio Schiellini. The young defender was seen as the next big footballing talent after this exceptional qualities with the RDVZ club. A then 19-year-old lit joined Bjorn Connery for an initial fee of 75 million euro over five-year deal in 2019. His performances have blown hot and cooled ever since making the move to the Allianz Stadium. That being said, at 22, the Dutch defender still has a lot of potential to develop as a professional at the elite stage. His time in Italy would have helped him develop a unique side of his game. He would have also benefited greatly from sharing a dressing room with legends of the game such as Leonardo Bonucci and Shellini. The Dutch international has already notched up 111 appearances, bagging at goals and to assist in the process of the Italian club to date. The Turin base club went through a bit of a rough patch in the last couple of seasons, but now seems to be regaining its structure once again. Those who have seen him play would understand the kind of dominance his physique brings in the defensive third of the pitch for his team and that is also the case on sub pieces. Despite being so young, his reading of the game and defensive acumen comes across as that of an experienced player. The Blues are facing a sense of uncertainty with question marks over the long-term future of Andres Christensen, Antonio Rudiger and Cesar Spilicueta. Hence purchasing a young defender with substantial experience would be a great move for the West Londoners. Philip still has his prime years ahead of him. He could thus become the heart of our central defence, should we manage to secure a move for him. The possibility of that looks highly unlikely at the moment, but there is a fee that has been quoted for him above, and if it is met, it remains to be seen that the old lady make of it. It would also be interesting to see how our potential new owners will tackle the potential defensive exodus that is on the cards at the moment. It certainly won't be an easy task, and a potential rebuild may be on the cards. With that in mind, Chelsea will be hoping that they can finish the season on a high as it would possibly help them lure young talented players to the club in a bit to secure their long term future. Making the top four is a minimum for us, which we are on course to achieve. Two wins in the FA Cup will see us back our first trophy this season after the club failed to build on the early promise shown during the start of the PL season. We have Real Madrid to take on tonight in the UCL last eight, but with a 3-1 deficit from the first leg, the task looked very, very difficult.